Hello everybody! In this video we are going to learn how to take the derivative of absolute value of x and in general any absolute value functions. Absolute value of x is differentiable at every point except at 0 because at 0 we have a spike here, it's not differentiable. We can express absolute value of x as square root of x to the second this is equal to absolute value of x. So we can take the derivative of square root of x to the second. So we can express it as x to the second raised to the one half and we can apply power rule and the chain rule. So we bring power to the front which is going to be one half x to the second and subtract one from the power which is going to be negative one half and we need to multiply this by the derivative of inside function which is 2x. Now let's rewrite everything here and clean up. So 2 cancels 2 and we can bring this to the denominator as the positive power and x stays on the numerator. So it's going to be x over x to the second raised to the one half. And we know that x to the second raised to the one half is our absolute value of x. So derivative of absolute value of x is x over absolute value of x. Let's generalize this. We know that by the chain rule derivative of any function is dy over du times du over dx which is derivative of absolute value of u is equal to u over absolute value of u times u prime. So let's take the derivative of let's say 3x minus 5. So the derivative will be by the generalized rule will be u over absolute value of u times derivative of u which is derivative of 3x minus 5 is 3. So it is 3 times 3x minus 5 over absolute value of 3x minus 5. I think you can take the derivative of any absolute value function using this generalized rule. Thank you for watching. 